the electricity department, particularly addressing the issue of downtime uh, on the 11 kVA feeder line. So I am really happy uh, that we are doing this today. So I request uh, Sneha Parthay to welcome the chief guest of the day and uh, Mr. Sri Ramkrishna Jawlika with a rose. I'd like to welcome uh, Dr. Vivek Kamat sir, our Director of Technical Education for this program. He has always been supportive of this and today he's been with us. So we are very happy sir that you were able to join us today. We welcome you with us sir. I'd like to welcome uh, the Chief Engineer uh, Stephen Fernandez, he has been very supportive of this program. Uh, he has uh, decided to implement it in five more places. So, welcome, you, sir. Uh, I'd like to welcome all the present media people who are here in a large number uh, because we want this message to go to people that uh, in engineering colleges we just don't teach education about systems and the thing, but we are also developing products, we are also making engineers who are going to become, uh, you know, entrepreneurs. So that's the point that we are trying to highlight today and uh, that's the intent of this whole launch event. Uh, most importantly, I'd like to also thank the electricity department which came forward two years ago when my students decided to do this project along with J.H. Piroker. Uh, the electricity department uh, came forward and said, okay, we are ready to try it out. We will be showing a short video of this also, how we started two years ago. And in two years, we have done a lot. Uh, in the next one year, uh, while this equipment is getting tested at five or six different locations after today's launch event, it will be further tested. Field testing will happen at five or six locations. Uh, we will be taking the feedback and then we will be upgrading it to the final version and that final version will be deployed at I think nearly 200 locations across the state. We will be sharing more information on this uh, during the course of the event. Uh, so I would like to thank all my students, the four students are here with us, so you welcome them along with the parents, the proud parents, thank you all for supporting the students in developing this product and carrying it beyond. They have all graduated from GEC, but they are still working for GEC and uh, they are, the spirit is what is important. Uh, so with that, um, I thank all of you for joining and including my colleagues and faculty members who are here for this event. Welcome you all. Sir. Thank you, sir. Now I call upon Mr. Ronald Charles to share his experience about the design, development and testing of the product. Um, hello, good morning, all. Sir, Pauli uh, Mitlai Mahasabhan, thank you, Madam Sutta. I'm the esteemed guest, I'm the manager of President Asa. Uh, Sri Minister of Power, Sri Sudhir Dawadikar, sir. I'm the uh, Director of ET, Dr. Vivek Kamal, sir. I'm the Chief Electrical Engineer, Stephen Parana, sir. I just got a thank you, Madam Sutta, because you have been busy since that time. I'm the launch of the product launch of the company, Anasar Media, sir. It's a big deal for us, for our team, and for our college, so thank you. So, I have a product as a remote controller for sectionizer. You have me answer a final year project with one person to look at them. So, I have a product that I have called. They have a project guide as a professor Jairus Priyorkar and an assistant engineer, Sri Nithil Prabhu. They have a coordinate. So, they have a discussion that they have a sectionizer as a feeder. They have to operate the line of the line during the point finding. They have to operate the line of the line of the line. सेक्शन आइसोलेट कर चुका था, सो वाइन ऑफ ऑटोमेटिक इस प्रोसेस, अच्छी लेकिन करने के लिए एंड बीच दस इस आइडिया, सो अमी तो चैलेंज किया था, वे एक्सेप्टेड इट, एंड वी हैव बीन वर्किंग ऑन इट फॉर द पास्ट वन ईयर, एंड एक उस वर्ष नो, तेज़ जाम सुधा अमी कॉलेज, सॉफ्टन सुधा तेज़ काम कर and we get producer, we are constantly coordinating on the on-site testing and time card. And we have to do this project, and we have to do this department, and we have to do this time to do this time. We have to do this whole process, we have to do this operate, we have to do this isolate, and we have to do this healthy section restore. We have to do this new time, and we have to do this directly as a benefit, so we have to do this end consumer matter. So, we have to do this work, and we have to do this work. And the other thing is that we have to do this work. 
how to locate exactly which is the faulty section and how to isolate the faulty section, restore the algae line as the student already detailed out. It's a big challenge. Sometimes it takes from 8 hours to 24 hours. And I'm sorry to say, but sometimes you know, it, it takes more than a day. Because there are multiple faults on this overhead line, especially in these regions. Only in Udgaon, Bichuli, where the lines are passing through dense forests. So today, the efforts made, I want to appreciate the students, the project, the Professor Jayesh Naik, who guided the team, GRK sir, the principal, who has put a lot of efforts to guide the students, and the product has a lot of innovations. Today, with that remote control, we'll be able, sitting at one place, we can easily by sending an SMS, we'll be able to control it. We'll be able to isolate, and we can recharge, charge the line and restore healthy life, thereby giving the benefit and satisfaction of the consumer. Today we get a lot of calls, even if I put 10 people, 20 people, 30 people, it becomes difficult because we cannot simply add people for restoration when they don't know the lines, the network, because there can be safety issues. There can be, you know, life threatening issues if we try to send anybody during that pressure, there can be accidents. So with the limited staff that we have, with those staff only should be able for us to restore the life. And it is possible only with this product, the remote controller, by which sitting at substation, will be able to disconnect the sectionalizer by sending remotely a signal. So the message will go to the station operator, thereby he will come to know, yes, what section is isolated, he will be able to make a decision by which he can put on the breakers, charge the feeders, and definitely the efforts made by the GC students are big, it's not small. And I would say we all wait after you know coming, passing out of the college, where we will get the job. I would tell you or give a message to you, start, start your own be an entrepreneur, because you can make huge money if you become an entrepreneur. And today, by implementing and successfully testing on one of the feeders, we have proven that yes, we can make the best product. And I want to congratulate the parents also. Your children have done a fantastic job. Boost them. Don't make them, you know, go and work under someone. Let them be a employers. With this, I want to thank the college once again. It's my own college. I feel a proud feeling. I want to congratulate and appreciate the students, the parents, and everybody. I want to thank Sir also, who has taken a decision to collaborate. Because only with academics, industries, and utilities, when they all three come together, we can have a lot of good things, and the benefit can pass to the state and to the country. Sir, once again, thank you for having the collaboration with the students. And as well, Sir, we really demand go ahead, commission to go for another five, not only five, if it is really successful, though we are testing it with all one feeder, we will see that we will implement it on our other feeder. I know it is very, very cost effective. Being a startup, the cost will definitely be low, much, much lower than all these MNCs and the big companies who are making this remote control. Once again, I want to thank each one of you who were, who were part of this product design and getting it implemented. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Now, may I request the director, Directorate of Technical Education, Dr. Vivek Kamath, to share his views. Honorable Minister for Power, Mr. Vivekar Sir, Chief Electrical Engineer, Principal GSC, Mr. William Shea, Head of Department, Members of Faculty, Officers from Electricity Department, and today's heroes and their proud parents. We are here for launching of this remote controller for sectionalizer and 11 kV distribution feeder. A typical electrical engineering terminology. I am not from electrical field of electrical engineering, but I do understand something about power distribution and power supply. I think all of you will agree with me that when we talk of power supply, the reliability of power supply is what is talked about most generally. And when we say reliability, it is, in simple terms, uninterrupted required power supply. And if at all there are some interruptions, 
effort should be there on part of the service providers to reduce the downtime. Now, what is major contributor of downtime? Of course, it is the fault in the transmission line. When it comes to 33 kV, I don't think the interruptions is very rare given. But 11 kV transmission lines, if at all there is some interruption, it affects a very large number of consumers compared to say 440 line interruption or 230 volts interruption. Now, in this attending the fault of 11 kV distribution transmission line fault, the time to go to that isolator and switch off or isolate that particular part of the transmission line and after attending to the fault, going back again there and putting it on or recharging it, that consumes substantial time. And if we automate it, then at least that much time will be reduced, the downtime part will be reduced. And from that point of view, I think really this is a commendable innovation by our students. As Tibinger said, from a remote location you can operate that isolator and isolate the section. Now, for a moment I was just confused between whether it is the sectionalizer or section analyzer. I mean, now it is very clear. It's not identifying or locating the fault, but when somebody is tending to the fault, how to isolate the section. So it is sectionalizing. Now when we put it off, just a word of caution, be very sure when to put it off. Because it is over mobile and I don't know. Of course there will be some authorization protocol. And at least isolation is not that important, but the recharging is very critical. When everything is safe, then only you should do that. So please take enough care of that. So I take this opportunity to wish all the very best to our four innovators, four in the guide, and of course the head of the department and the professors from the college. And this is just maybe a beginning. A lot of innovations are yet to come. Of course, in this area itself there can be further improvement. But even otherwise, in electrical or all other branches of engineering, there is tremendous scope for innovation and you have shown the right path for your fellow students who are in the battle. So, congratulating the heroes of the day, I end my rewards. Thank you. Thank you, sir. May I now request the Honorable Minister, Sri Ram Krishna Tavikar, to formally launch the program.
Now, we have a 5 minute video explaining the working of the product. Hello, I am Jayesh Priyotar, Associate Professor in Electrical Department of Goa College of Engineering. Our students have developed a, a prototype model for a sectionalized and control, which will be practically implemented in a Goa Electricity Department. They have done this as a final year project, and we were able to successfully implement a project on the sectionalizer at a OPA FIDA. Now I just hand over to my student who will explain the operation of the sectionalizer. Uh, hello, uh, this is our final year project, remote operation of sectionalizer using mobile application. Myself, Raunak Chari, and along with my three other more team members, uh, Fred Barboza, Ishwari Gaukar, and Ujwala, uh, Ujwala Shanba. Uh, our guide is very and this is our project. Let me introduce to our project. This is our casing of the project. As you can see, we have a microcontroller and we have two buck converters. The supply is given 24 volts in here and it is tapped down to be powered to the buck controller or to the microcontroller as well as the GSM module. The GSM module is the one that will be receiving the commands, open or close commands and the microcontroller will be firing the relays which will drive the control signals to the sectionalizer. So this is the basic operation of a module. Hello. This is Nitin Prabhu, uh, Assistant Engineer from Electricity Department, Konda. This is regarding a project done by a GC student when there was joint discussion with uh, Professor Jayesh Kumar Priyodhar about this uh, project and uh, he suggested to have a, a opening and closing of the sectionalizer through SMS. This uh, Konda subdivision 2 is having total 90 kilometer networks of ABC cable with 18 numbers of sectionalizers. So whenever line becomes faulty, there was large delay in uh, sectionalizing the line. So with this project, now what we have achieved is uh, we can control the sectionalizer by sending an SMS for, from the authorized person like uh, station operator, junior engineer or assistant engineer and send directly the message from the sectionalizer when feeder gets faulty. So presently the project has been implemented on 11 kV OPA feeder on trial basis at the tail end and successful trial operation of this project has been already carried out and it is found to be successful. So we are thinking of going ahead of this uh, with this project on all the feeders wherein suppose if you provide the sectionalizer at half of the feeder then sectionalization can be done within a span of one or two minutes and healthy section can be restored within no time especially in the rainy season when multiple feeders are getting faulty. So now, I, so now, today, now we'll carry out the operation of this sectionalizer. To carry out the operation, I have to just uh, type a message A B C D and send it on the register number. So I'm typing A B C D, and this is, message is forwarded to the SIM card which is on the sectionalizer. When I send the message. I will get the reply that message has been delivered to the particular SIM number. Now I am receiving the message enter the operation. So to, now we will know the status of the sectionalizer. To know the status just we have to type a letter S and send it to the SIM card. Again I will receive the, the message has been delivered after which I will get the message that sexualizer is closed same you can confirm it on the side at present stage the sexualizer is closed now I want to open the sexualizer by sending the message so for opening just I have to type letter O and forward it message is to be forwarded the message has been forwarded to the sectionalizer. It is already delivered. Now, now to confirm, I have to just, I received the message, press 1 to confirm. So I am pressing 1 to confirm and again I am sending the same message. Now again this message will again go to the sectionalizer and now you can see the sectionalizer has opened. 
Or again, if you want to close the centralizer, in case feeder is faulty, this operation can be carried out by the operator or JE who is authorized to carry out the operation. Now, we will take the close, now I got the message that centralizer is open by so and so number. So this message will go to the, all the numbers who are registered to AE, JE or an operator. Now we will close the centralizer. For closing the centralizer, just we have to type letter C and forward it on the same number. Moment I send the message C, it is sent. I am. I will, this is, it is delivered to the number. And now again, I will get the message to press one to the to confirm the, my operation. So I am pressing one, and again I am forwarding it same to the same number. Now you can see that after sending the message, sexlizer is goes through by sending an. SMS. So this is the project done by uh, GC student and uh, it is guided by Mr. Uh, um, Professor Jayesh Kumar Priyorkar. Now we have successfully taken the trial and commissioned this and about 50 operations have been carried out on this sexualizer for correct operation of the same. This project is done by the students of Goa Engineering College, Mr. Ravanak Chari, Fred Baboza, Ujwala Sanpat, and Ishwari Gaunkar, and guided by Professor Jayesh Kumar Tiolkar, and implemented in Subdivision 2, Division 10 Electricity Department, Ponda, on 11 kV Oppa feeder at Nandan 1 Sex Lizer. Just uh, for the benefit of the audience, this product has been patented and the uh, patent application has been received at uh, the Mumbai Patent Office. So in next one year, the official patent will be released. So we are protected by patent. May I now request the Honorable Minister to address the cabinet. specially designed and developed by Goa Engineering College and their electrical and electronic engineering department. And the functional and non-direction the major role. Director of Technical Education, Babi Vikram. Andre Engineering College Principal Krupa Shankar, Andre Chief Engineer Stephen Rodney from Fernandes, Head of the Department of Shade, such as Mark Kumarga, Azhar Shine, Professor Yordar, by Ronald Chani, Fred Barbosa, Shuri Gaunkar, Udwala Shama, Jani, Nesabre. At the time, we come back to Subhati Rehmi, sir. By 2020, we started this. 2021-22, it was completed. And in calendar, launching ceremony, it was at the parents' alignment, sir. All professors of OI, engineering, college staff of our, our department, Patrika, media, and Sadhguru, and Amazamilya, Actually, this was supposed to be done one year back, but we could not make it. Maybe some of the reasons. But as the Jim Patrakar news, especially media, the media, the correct thing was done. We also would have been in India, also very terrible to the extent. We have to check in with the doctors and not to be the news, the correct thing was done. And he, yeah, news. जी है ता ताज़े तो हम जब परफॉर्मेंस ही है सा कहीं पोस्टी उस वासाती ज़रूर मुझे नहीं आता 
आणि जाणून बुजून जायनासना किंवा गोष्टी जाता पाहिजे त्याचा काहीतरी व्हेरिफिकेशन करावं लागेल असे प्रयत्न करतात पण तो प्रयत्न गेले कित्येक वर्ष आमच्या पावर डिपार्टमेंट करतात डिफरंट वे आज आता मानून जाता कारण ज्यांना निकोस मागवली की कंट्रोल ऑफ बाय सेक्शनल रिलायजर ऑन स्पेशली जेवण के लिए डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन नेटवर्क आहे असा कारण आमचे जे मॅक्सिमम डिस्ट्रीब्यूशन असते जेवण के लिए आणि त्या खातीर आमचा जो रिमोट एरियाज प्रॉब्लेम आहे तो प्रॉब्लेम इज अ बिहाइंड आवर कंट्रोल इन स्पेशली इन सत्तर इशू देन धारबाडा वेरेवर देयर इज अ फॉरेस्ट एरिया सांगे कॅटे पार्ट सबर टू पुली आणि ज्या ज्या कडे अग्रिकल्चर सेक्टर थे थे वो प्रश्न मोठ्या प्रमाणात असतात आणि त्या दिवस आम्ही दोन गोष्टी करण्याचा प्रयत्न एक अंडरग्राउंड केबलिंग वर्क इन दिस पर्टिक्युलर एरिया आणि दुसरी गजा म्हणजे डेव्हलपमेंट इन द सेक्टर वेअर वी रिक्वायर्ड अ अटमोस्ट केअर म्हणजे फॉर एग्जांपल सिटी एरिया वी रिक्वायर्ड अटमोस्ट केअर कारण आमचे इंडस्ट्रीज आहेत वी रिक्वायर्ड अटमोस्फेअर प्लान जनरेशन आता रिमोट प्लेस म्हणजे आमचे जो सत्तर विभाग असतात दॅट इज ऑलवेज कंप्लेन ऑन डे एव्हरी डे आमचा प्रत्येक कंप्लेन ही त्या धारमाडा सत्तरी या भागातल्या सोडेल त्या खातीर थंय हो जो सेक्शनल आम्ही वापरले तर म्हाका दिसता मोठ्या प्रमाणात आमचे जे त्रास असतात ते कमी जातले असे म्हाका दिसतात आज एक नविदा आमच्या डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिकल इलेक्ट्रॉनिक इंजिनिअरिंग गोवा कॉलेज ऑफ इंजिनिअरिंग अलॉंग विथ द हेल्प ऑफ प्रिन्सिपल अँड प्रोफेसर प्रियोर्कर तुम्ही केली त्याबद्दल तुमच्या प्रयत्न तुमच्या पॅरेंट्सांच्या बसून अभिनंदन करता कारण ही गोष्टी कोणीतरी करपास मेळते आणि तिथे स्टार्टेड इन गोवा इंजिनिअरिंग कॉलेज बिकॉज इट इज इन माय कॉस्टुडेंट आय एम प्राउड दॅट इट गोवा इंजिनिअरिंग कॉलेज इट इज माय कॉस्टुडेंट आणि त्यामध्ये आय ऑल्सो टोल्ड प्रिन्सिपल the same department can work for at least half of the megawatt on solar energy definitely if students do that we can also help them in the entire project take up the so project can be done so just to be going in any college electronic electrical department the project for that of in solar energy definitely government of goa in help them because it is need of the and you know why atas principal atas tumcha patient has to be known to the patient and it has to be able to pass up bare kaam to be kare that tumcha man was to be done and that and i mean our objective is there and i am so start to be proud that i also request you to take cognizance of all this and start working in the electricity department thank you very much परत एकदा तुमच्या सगळ्यांचे तिन्ही भुरगे प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंटांनी आवय बापाय एकदा कॉन्ग्रेच्युलेशन करता आणि तसेच काम आम्ही करत राहूया देऊ थँक्यू सर थँक्यू सो मच नाव आय रिक्वेस्ट द ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर टू ऑनर विथ सर्टिफिकेट ऑफ अप्रिसिएशन Mr. Rana Chari Mr. Fred Barbosa
Miss Udwala Sharma. Miss Ishwari Gamkar. Now may I request Dr. Jia Kumpulekar, Head, Department of Electrical and Electronics, to propose the vote of thanks. Good afternoon, everybody. 